hello welcome to my channel and today's video if you're new here thank you so much for joining me don't forget to hit that subscribe button and if you're an OG freaking love you definitely hit that like button if you like this video today's topic is going to be true botanicals now I've been using them for like two to three years at this point and I wanted to make a video where I discussed the products that I like the most and the products that I like the least out of the range. So basically this is like a worst to best video. I figured it was time to share just because I've used certain products multiple times and I've repurchased and I just think that this will help guide you in the buying process and understanding what you need and what you don't need and things like that. So if you're interested in finding out the best and the worst products of True Botanicals, then go ahead and keep on watching. I do want to start out by saying that most of the products within True Botanicals that I use is from the Clear line. You can take a quiz online that will kind of direct you into which line you need to use specifically for your skin concerns. So they have like a renew, they have a calm line, they have a clear line. They also have a line for pregnancy. So definitely take that quiz if you're interested in True Botanicals and see where it guides you because you want to be using the products that will address your skin concerns. First, I want to start with this baby. So this is the Nourishing Cleanser, specifically talking about the Clear Nourishing Cleanser. I do like this product and this is kind of the case for every Everything that I've used from True Botanicals. I haven't tried a product that I hate that has messed with my skin that hasn't been a good product but the way that I'm rating this is basically based off of whether it's like a must or not in your skincare routine. Now at the bottom is the nourishing cleanser because it's very specific. I think this is a great product to make sure your skin is looking its best if you don't wear any makeup but if you do wear makeup you're going to need to buy another product to Take off your makeup because this doesn't do a good job of that. And then you can use this as a second step kind of cleanser. This does retail for $48, so it is quite pricey. So the key ingredients in this is green tea and white tea, black willow bark extract, and helichrysum. Basically, this cleanser has a ton of antioxidants. It has salicylic acid in here, which promotes exfoliation. And it's antibacterial and antifungal. So if you have really, really bad acne, or you're just prone to breakout around your period or something like that, this is a wonderful product to use on your skin to make sure that it's not irritated. But like I said, it's not something that you desperately need in your skincare routine. And I just think that if you're saving money, this is definitely not the product for you. Then that's that. Next, I'm gonna move into the Repair Serum, which obviously for me, it's in the clear. Once again, I do like this product, but at this point, there are products within the line that I think are better. This does retail for $140. It does have hyaluronic acid in it, bark willow extract and olive leaf extract, which basically means that this hydrates, exfoliates, and is very anti-inflammatory, which is why it's in the clear line. It does a good job of like soothing and sloth like slothing away skin that you don't need anymore. The next thing that I wanna talk about is their pure radiance oil. Now I have two clears and one calm. They had a sale on the calm because they were switching their formula, so I bought this just because I do love their oils. This is like their staple product, I want to say it's like what separates them out from everything else and at this point I don't like moisturizers I like an oil for my face that moisturizes. these retail for $110 the pure radiance oil in clear includes helichrysum hemp pumpkin and grapeseed oils and it also has algae extract and azanthacin I can never say that word right so basically it's antibacterial antifungal it balances your sebum it restores the pH in the skin which is very important if you have acne it improves elasticity it unclogs your pores it stimulates collagen which is really nice it diminishes a spot and discoloration which is very important especially if you do have breakouts and your skin tends to scar so this product is like kind of towards the end just because there is another oil that I like more than this um, but it's still obviously in the middle because it is such a staple and I wouldn't be using anything else besides a true botanicals oil for my skin anyways and then the calm oil has calendula oil in there ginger root oil and cucumber seed oil which basically just kind of means that it's anti-inflammatory and it minimizes signs of damage I definitely think for the calm oil is just a little basic. I guess if you don't have any skin concerns and your skin's just good and you're trying to keep it good, the calm oil is going to be your best bet. Um, but for $110, 
I think going with the Renew or the Clear Oil is kind of better anyways. The next thing that I want to talk about is tools. Now, just because there's so many products that I love so much from True Botanicals, this is just kind of where the tools ended up in. I have a face mask applicator and I have a face roller. I don't know if you can or cannot buy these separately. Um, they tend to be in bundles, but I think they're really, really high quality. They're very visually pleasing and very aesthetic. Um, it's nice to kind of just have all of this displayed out in the bathroom. This is wonderful. It just is so good to unclog everything in your face and make sure that your face is draining properly and is just at its best. Um, I have a whole video on face rolling. If you want to watch that, I'll link it up above. And then I really just love this brush. It, it is an interesting shape. It does a really good job of like dispersing the product. I just love them. But because there are more standout products within the line, that's why they're in this spot. So the last items over here are going to be like crawling up to the top items that I really, really love. So this is really hard to like place them in a specific area. Uh, but I do want to talk about the resurfacing mask. Um, it looks like this and it retails for $65. So resurfacing mask has lactic acid as avocado butter and exanthanin again. So basically it exfoliates, brightens the skin and nourishes the skin. It improves skin elasticity, which is very important the older that you get because that kind of gets diminished. Also improves skin texture and diminishes dark circles and um, hyperpigmentation, which is also really good as you're aging. Ever since I started using this product, my esthetician has been like, you need to wear sunscreen and take care of these dark spots that are forming. So I know that it's doing its job and I think this is absolutely a staple in any skincare routine. It's nice to just once a week apply this and feel good about your skin and know that you're taking care of things before they really get bad. It's very important to have in your skincare. That's why it's up, up at the top of the list basically. I just think it's great. I have used a lot of like physical exfoliants and chemical exfoliants. I feel like this is not only luxurious and it almost forces you to have like a spa day and take care of your skin, but it's just so good. It smells so good. It performs so well and it doesn't take a long time. It literally is two to five minutes on your face and you then have the smoothest and best skin that you could ever imagine. Then we have the vitamin C booster, and I have two of these because I'm psycho. This booster retails for $90. It does have vitamin C and ferulic acid in here, which fights free radicals, which is very important. I don't understand how that works, but apparently it's very important for your skin, so fight free radicals in any way that you can. It promotes collagen production, which is also good for anti-aging. It speeds up cell turnover, and this also reduces the development of wrinkles, fine lines, spots, and all of the things that come with aging. This is definitely a staple in your skincare routine. I think vitamin C in general is essential in your skincare routine because it's so freaking good for your skin. Definitely need it, definitely need it. Everyone needs it. I don't care what age you are. As soon as you're using skincare, vitamin C is what you need. So the next two products are the top two products. And these are like the replacements for the serum and the oil, like the original serum and the oil. Let's talk about the Chibula Active Immunity Serum. First of all, I love the fact that it is $90 versus $140. In here, you obviously have the Chibula. You have elderberry, ginger, and echinacea in here. And you also have low and high molecular hyaluronic acid which is very important so that the hyaluronic acid gets into the different layers depending on like what the molecular level of it is so this is the best antioxidant type of thing on the market it stimulates collagen production it regulates inflammation it maintains hydration reduces skin stress it's antiseptic it's antimicrobial it helps boost cellular turnover. It encourages healthy skin and that kind of gives you that healthy glow. And it also hydrates deeper because it does have that different levels of um, hyaluronic acid. Honestly, first of all, I love that it has a pipette versus a pump. I don't know, something about that to me just... I just like that more. It's a thinner formula, which I really like. I feel like that soaks into the skin even better. I just have seen the biggest change when I started using this serum. I feel like my skin was just plump and healthy and glowy and I didn't have as many like clogged pores. I just think this is brilliant and I definitely really just prefer this over the other serum. Once my other serum runs out, this is going to be my next purchase just because it's so freaking damn 
good. So the last thing I want to talk about, which is the best product of True Botanicals, is actually their newest addition. So this is the CBD 500 Anti-Inflammaging Treatment Oil. This retails for $120, which is $10 more than the regular oil, but it does have 500 milligrams of CBD in here. It is squalene and it is C buckthorn oil. So this reduces inflammation. It also reduces pain, which is great for like breakouts and things like that, or if you have redness, if you have rosacea and and things like that. This does also soothe the look of wrinkles. It soothes your dehydrated barrier. It balances uneven skin tone. It provides omega fatty acids to improve the skin barrier, which is very important because that's kind of the first thing that gets stripped down and then addresses the effects of skin aging. This basically replaces the clear oil for me. Um, I only use this at nighttime, but if I do have redness on my skin, I will use it in the daytime and kind of spot treat it just because CBD tends to make me a little bit sleepy and I need to be as awake as I can during the day because I'm already sleeping all the time anyways. So I am obsessed with this, honestly. Their newest addition to the line and I think it's definitely something that they should have had a really long time ago. Now the problem with CBD is making sure that you have a high standard of it, like a high quality of it, and obviously buying from True Botanicals is your best way to make sure that you have that box check. I just really love CBD at nighttime and just like any kind of product that I can get. Um, it just, when I use this oil, it just kind of like takes away all of the stress from my day and it winds me down. And when I lay down to bed, I can fall asleep much easier. It's done wonderful things for my skin. It's so good for when you do have breakouts. I just love it. It's so freaking good. And I just think it's the best product the True Botanicals has come out with. And I think um, if you're interested in trying anything, I would suggest you try the CBD oil first and then go down the line. Um, you obviously do have to be 18 to um, order the CBD. Everything else is fair game for no matter how old you are. I love True Botanicals and everything that they come out with is amazing because I know that it's not including any toxins and any bad things for me. And I can use skincare that does what it's supposed to do and it doesn't damage my body because what you put on your skin goes inside of you whether you want to admit it or not. So buying kind of a little bit more expensive products to make sure that your body's taken care of as well as your skin is so, so important. So as always, everything is clinically proven and it's clean and sustainable. It's not an endocrine disruptor, which is really important to use products that don't disturb your hormones. It's free of carcinogens, parabens, SLLs, SLEs, phthalates, synthetic fragrances, and GMOs, and it's also cruelty-free, which is very, very important to me. So all of these products will be listed down below. I'm obsessed with all of them. They're just great. It just depends on what your skincare needs are and what your budget is. So if it is your first order, you do get 15% off. And if there are any codes that I find online, I will definitely list them. They do have sales here and there um, and codes available here and there. And then when you come back to order things, if you set it to be an automatic subscription, it does take 15% off. So essentially you always get 15% off. So that is all that I have to say. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.